Hello, and uh, welcome to this new thing I'm doing called Seen It All Before. Uh, where I'm going to basically react to something I've already watched um, and, you know, kind of annoy you by talking about it. Like, I'm, I'll be like that guy who sits next to you in um, in the cinema. Oh yeah, you know that guy? He he was in uh, he was in Batman as well, you know. Uh, we're going to watch Blake 7. Um, we're going to watch first episode 1 of season 1 of Blake 7 called The Way Back. Here we go. Oh, music's playing. Oh, that music. It's kind of it's kind of got a weird Discord to it. Um, tried to tried to learn it. Cannot play it on the guitar. It's Blake. Some of them have got silly names, but uh, we'll come to that later. That's, uh, yeah, I don't want to give too much away. Blake Seven. Notice there's no apostrophe. And it's also invented by Terry Nation, who was the guy who invented the Daleks. So that's just worth mentioning. They control the population with the food. Like McDonald's. You hear from the lunch? I get his tapes a couple of times a year. What is, what is this? I was told you had some news about. No, not me. Everything was tapes in the 70s. Especially asked to contact you so you could tell me the past. He was on the other five a few months ago. Where is he now? Waiting for us. Outside. Outside? Outside? The air's fresh, so it's not. When you realize going outside is a category four crime, we do know the law. Yes. So uh, category two is um, not tying your shoelace. Category three is uh, urinating in public. <laughs> it's natural water. The stuff we get's been recycled a thousand times, and it's dosed with suppressants. I'll check ahead. Watch and he just spat in it. They've been stepping up the suppressants because the number of dissidents is growing. Well, clearly, it's not working, then, is it? You need to change to the tactic rather than suppressants. Signal. There's something about his memory, I forgot what it is. Beware the ginger man. But not because he's ginger. It's interesting from the point of view of film as opposed to uh, video. So this has been shot on film, as you can tell by its grainy and the way it moves and the way it's lit. And it, it just looks, pe it, it kind of looks a bit more flat. Um, and because when the BBC did stuff like this. Whenever they went out, they couldn't take the big video cameras when they were too heavy, so they took out like 8mm or 16mm cameras. And so that's why everything looks a bit different when it's outside. His cape thing is kind of cool. He intended to uh, presumably still deliver it in a very matter of fact way. That's not true. I hear from them regularly. I had a vis tape only a month ago. Those tapes are fakes. Part of the treatment to keep your memory suppressed. But that would have given the cause a martyr. So instead, they put you into intensive therapy. They erased areas of your mind. They implanted new. Total recall, anyone? <laughs> I'll just punch either side of your face. Him if he can no. be deported to Cygnus Alpha. 
Doctor, it's am a I right prison thinking planet. you can create experiences, implant them into a subject, who will then believe that they really happened? Of course. In fact, creating an illusion of reality is quite simple. Good. Then I think we can totally destroy Blake's credibility and get him sentenced. But I'd like to do a feasibility check. Doctor, would you come with me, please? This is just like the most monstrous thing. I want to bring charges soon, Warwick. Why should report back? He can identify me. My whole operation is at risk. I'll be satisfied when the risk is eliminated. Nothing to do with being ginger. He's just evil. Assault on a minor. Attempting to corrupt minors. Moral deviation. It's, as it's like it's 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 just horrible. Did like oh yeah, he's now a paedophile. It's just like Jesus. We're involving children. None of this is true. Of course not. That's why you surprised me when you said you plead guilty. We should put on to this, not to these charges. Well, they are the only ones that have been brought against you. And I must tell you frankly, the evidence against you is very damaging. <laughs> she does. She obviously thinks it's quite funny. Flashing lights! This is, this is no system of justice. iPod looks messed up. I'm Telvaran with the Justice Department. I want to run a check on the medical records of those children. You'll have to wait until morning. I want them now. Well, if you have a little piece of card with a picture on, that's fine. It must have, it, it can't have all happened in the space of a day. So it's maybe what? A couple of weeks later? This is this is sloppy work. They should they should have cleaned it up at least, shouldn't they? Oh, he's gone. Entirely full size spaceship. Like a transporter accident. Killed instantly. Very tragic. See you will you? I'm entrusting the entire fabrication of this death to you, lowly soldier number seven. They're still not dry. Lee Simpson, top dude. We go, nineteen seventy-eight. So the year after Star Wars came out. Still using that modern futuristic sci-fi where everything's clean. Um, Star Wars was the thing that really changed that, and that people didn't really realise that that's what had changed it. So. Well, that is, um, that's Blake 7, episode 1. As you can see, it's very slow. Um, and they've just literally messed with kids' heads to make them think that they were abused by a guy. It's, uh, it's, it's like the most horrific premise for a sci-fi show. It's just like, oh my god. Um, but yeah, it's a great show, great show. Bad effects, but a good show. Um, 
and it just goes I mean as I say we've not even got seven yeah still three so um, yes join me next time for the next thrilling installment of seen it all before bye well thank you very much for watching uh, I've got links to like social media down there and subscribe to the video and comments